Uh, good morning, I would like to uh, congratulate all our graduates. I can't be proud of all your achievement you made at the University of Leicester, a prestigious university in the UK. Our computing subject is world top 200 and also UK top 20s based on the Times Higher Education World University ranking this year. We are extremely proud to be celebrating our university's centenaries this year. From the beginnings, we have celebrated the power of education to shape positive changes to the world. Starting at the University of Leicester make you a part of a unique century-long legacy. As a university uh, 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 graduate, you should be proud, very proud as a graduation is a true milestone in your life. Graduating is a great achievement under any circumstance. You all went through so much to make it to these days after three or four years hard work. Some of you overcome series of obstacles during your undergraduate study. I know 2020 is a special year for you as you need to cope with these unprecedented situations caused by the COVID-19 pandemic. By conducting your final year project and also your final assessment remotely during the lockdown. You also need to deal with a lot of uncertainty when you are graduating. But trust me, the pandemic is just short-term crisis. The COVID-19 is not only a crisis, but also an opportunity for you to think carefully about your future. I would like to quote Albert Einstein who said, in the midst of every crisis lies great opportunity. It's a time for you to take charge of your own life. You need to decide what is really important to you and what is the values you want to live by and also what kind of careers you would like to pursue. As our alumni, our door will be always open for you. If you decide to go back to study our master's or PhD programs, please let us know and we are going to offer you generous alumni discount. Okay, next I would like to move on and present you a message from our president and vice chancellor, Professor Nishan Kanagarajas, and also short videos from our pro-vice chancellor, head of college, Professor Pro Monks. Hi. I'm Nishan Kanagaraja. I'm the Vice Chancellor of your university. I was really looking forward to my first summer graduation ceremony with you. But we all know why we cannot hold a face-to-face -face event this year. But I just want to tell you how proud we are of your achievements, especially during these difficult times. We as a university community want to congratulate you and wish you the very best in your future. We want you to go out there and make a difference. I want you to make yourself, your family, and this university proud. You are our citizens of change. All the best. Congratulations. I'm Professor Paul Monks. I'm the Pro Vice Chancellor and Head of the College of Science and Engineering here at the University of Leicester. And on this happy virtual occasion, I want to add my voice to many others saying, well done and congratulations for all your hard work over the years. Under normal circumstances, I would be reading your names as you cross the stage at the Montfort Hall. And it can be sometimes a little bit hit and miss. But I do hope that you will join us again next summer for a graduation in person. Until that time, enjoy your virtual graduation. Enjoy the success that you really deserve after your hard work over the years. And please go on and be successful in whatever career you choose. But do remember, we will support you here at the University of Leicester in your future, and we won't forget you and do stay in contact with us. But again, congratulations on this happy occasion. Thank you. Okay, I believe everyone here knows our uh, directors of the learning and teachings, uh, Dr. Uh, Richard Craig. Unfortunately, Richard cannot join today's events to congratulate you face to face. But he has recorded a short video for you. I would like to present a short video from our director of learning and teaching. I'm Dr. Richard Craggs, and I'm the Director of Learning and Teaching at our school. 
Um, you may know me as your teacher. So if you're an undergraduate, I've probably taught you quite a lot. But if not, then you probably know me better from my emails trying to explain the rules around uh, safety nets and exams. And I think that captures my job pretty well. I'm a teacher and someone who explains rules and regulations. And so it's nice today to be doing something a little bit more celebratory and um, to say a huge congratulations to you all uh, for graduating. This, especially the last six months, has been much more challenging than any of us could ever have imagined. And I just want to thank you all. The attitude and the resilience of our students has been incredible. I speak to a lot of different people around the university. And during this time, a lot of schools really struggled with students um, demanding things, wanting to you know, get extra stuff because of what's going on. And that just hasn't been the case in our school. We've all just kind of got on with it, done our best uh, and, and approached it with such a fantastic attitude. And I must thank you so much for that. Um, all across uh, the country and indeed the world, uh, hundreds of thousands of students are all um, graduating around now. And it's, it's easy to think of it kind of en masse. Congratulations, everybody. You've all done super well. Um, off you go. And the COVID crisis, I think, has really shone a light on how it's so different for individuals. Everybody has their own individual struggles. And through the crisis, everyone has had kind of individual circumstances they've had to deal with. And it's really shone a light on that. And it's, it's certainly opened my eyes. And it's made me reflect that every one of you to get where you are today has achieved so much. So not only through the assignments and grades, yeah, that's part of it, but the individual struggles that you've each had to go through to get here today. I, I've been lucky enough to, to share. You, you've shared some of those with me and in some ways I've been able to help. But I know that for many of you, you will have had difficulties and challenges throughout your degree, much bigger than I could ever know. And so congratulations and well done. And I hope that in the summer months, you can just take some time to sit and reflect and think about how far you've come. The, the friends you've made, the skills you've developed, the achievements you've um, achieved, but also the growth of you as an individual and thinking back across the, the one to five years of your degree, how far you've come. Well done. And I hope that you'll be proud to have a graduate of, of Leicester University on, on your CV and on that certificate for a long time to come. Um, I think it'd be nice to be able to give you some advice, some, some wise words to, um, to take with you on your way as, after you graduate. Um, that's difficult because the world that you'll be graduating into is very different from the one that I think you and, and we were expecting. And it'll be very different in six months, 12 months, two years time. And so it's difficult to know what to say, except that the world is up for grabs. Um, the paths are not as clearly set and the lines are not as clearly drawn as they usually are. And so in many ways, it's up to you. There's, there's opportunities much greater than has ever been before and challenges, but you're the generation that will, that will draw those lines and clear those paths and make those decisions and develop our future. And I'm, and I'm, I'm hopeful very hopeful having taught you and seen you and seen you grow I'm hopeful um, that you're the right people to, to kind of set that path and to succeed um, rather than try and describe this myself um, which I'd, I'd, I'd struggle to do I'd like to share with you um, something uh, this is this is a, this is dr. Seuss so you may you may have read cat in the hat or, or the Grinch uh, the Grinch who stole Christmas but this is my favorite and with my two young children I'll, I'll read this to them as often as they will allow. And I would like to just share a little bit of this with you. You have brains in your head. You have feet in your shoes. You can steer yourself any direction you choose. You're on your own and you know what you know. And you are the guy and gal who will decide where to go. Out there, things can happen and frequently do to people as brainy and footsy as you. And when things start to happen, don't worry, don't stew. Just go right along, you'll start happening too. Oh, the places you'll go. Wherever you fly, you'll be best of the best. Wherever you go, you will top all the rest. 
except when you don't, because sometimes you won't. I'm sorry to say, but sadly it's true, that bang-ups and hang-ups can happen to you. But on you will go, though the weather be foul. On you will go, though your enemies prowl. On you will go, though the hack and cracks howl. Onward up many a frightening creek, though your arms may get sore and your sneakers may leak. But will you succeed? Yes, you will, indeed. 98 and three quarter percent guaranteed. Kid, you'll move mountains. So, whether your name be Buxbaum or Bixby or Bray or Mordecai, Ali, Van Allen, O'Shea, you're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting. So, get on your way. Thank you and stay in touch. Okay, great. So, okay, and now I will hand over to a Dr. Genoveva's uh, uh, Cavalidos, a representative of our academic staff members, to deliver a message from our teaching staff. Dear all, dear students, from all the teaching staff here at the School of Informatics, we will heartedly congratulate you. You have achieved so much, especially during the, the, these hard times. But I have to admit that what I've been saying and feeling really is that despite the COVID-19 lockdown, especially, you know, those of you um, in the third year of your studies, I felt that despite our distance and the remote working, we came closer. And I do hope that you do feel the good wishes, the caring and the support and pride we have for all of you. And um, we, we are sending you actually right now. I'm pretty sure that in the future, you will be saying that you have been graduating in strange times. Well, while this is true, um, please remember that the strange times and challenges can equip us with amazing capabilities and skills. And this is what happened to you as well now. So skills such as courage, strength, resilience, uh, stubbornness in a good way will help you very much and will, uh, will constitute transferable skills for your future professional and personal lives. Please do keep in touch because we do look forward to see your future success. What I want you to, 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 to do really and wish you is to keep growing and keep adding to what this world needs most. And this is goodness, this is beauty, and of course, informatics services to improve people's lives and well-beings. Keep developing your own unique dreams and talents that actually make you who you are. And be bold and do great things in your lives. We are all here to support you throughout. We really want to wish you all the very best, always, from all of us here at the School of Informatics. Thank you very much and take care. Okay, I think I'm up next. Um, so I have the pleasure to present some prizes um, to our, our prize winners. So that I have a slide to share. So of course you are the winners will not be getting the actual prizes in this ceremony, but you will um, uh, receive them in the post, uh, I suppose. So we have a number of prizes. Uh, so first up, we have this May Computer Prize, which is awarded to our best um, final year, in terms of final year performance, the uh, under, uh, computer science students. And this is Puria Tupchi. And next up, we have a uh, fin best uh, final year prize, which is awarded to the um, overflow, in terms of overflow performance to our computer science student, which is Mr. Hoshio Damendra. And then we have a computer science third year prize, which is awarded to our best computing or computing with management students. And so this is uh, Mr. Lucas Kefishis. And then we have a number of project prizes. So one for each stream of degree. So for computer science, this is awarded to Mr. Puria Tupchi. And for computing projects, this goes to Brandon Neef. And for computing with management, this goes to Mikhail Kolasek. And something new this year is that we have a video competition, which students are invited to submit a video to present their projects. We receive a number of submissions and uh, 
uh, we decided uh, the award goes to uh, Afni Nanda. And finally, uh, the BCS, the British Computer Society, have given us a number of free memberships to a uh, number of students. So we decided these uh, are the students who will receive this uh, uh, awards. So for sure, the Mandra, Giselle Haroon, Joshua Mayo, Uriya Tupchi, and Hina Matalia. So uh, warm congratulations to all these uh, uh, winners. Okay, great. You know, I would like to uh, congratulate all our award winners for their great achievement made at the University of Leicester. Okay, so now I, now I would like to present a pre-record congratulations uh, from the Student Union's executive. Hi everyone, I'm Mia, I'm your Student Union President, and I just wanted to take this time out to say a huge congratulations, you've made it, you're graduates. Um, this year has probably been the most tumultuous year, or one of the students on campus at Leicester. Um, you are the first and only students to go through a whole pandemic and graduate. Um, I know that the ceremonies have been postponed and to a lot of students that will be awful um, and a really huge opportunity that they were looking forward to having. Um, but I hope to see as many of you as possible um, next July and next January to celebrate in person. Wishing you all the best um, in your next endeavours and well done because you made it. Hi everyone, my name is Adnan, I'm the Students Union Education Officer. Just a huge congratulations from me to all of you for graduating. I know it's in unfortunate circumstances, um, but well done even so, and I hope you're all safe. Um, remember what you've learned, not only in your degree, but from each other and from the people you've met in your time here, um, and utilise that to, to help change things and to help change the world. I, I have faith that everyone here has, has an ability to, to impact things and to really uh, progress the world in a more just and sustainable way. Thank you. Hi everybody, I'm Tony Magaya and I'm your Liberation Officer. So I really want to congratulate you on this amazing, amazing achievement. You guys have been through so many hurdles this year, the biggest one being coronavirus, but you came out in the end and here you are flourishing on this amazing day. So today I really want you to remember your experiences, go out in the world and slay it because the world is definitely your stage. Hi guys, I'm Carly, your wellbeing officer. I want to say a huge congratulations to everyone who is graduating this year. You have overcome so much throughout your degree. Not only have you had to deal with strikes, but you've also graduated in spite of a global pandemic. Just know that you can do anything you put your mind to and overcome all obstacles in your way. I wish you all the best of luck and I know that you are all going to accomplish incredible things. Congratulations to our fellow 2020 graduates. We know it's not been our year, but we hope you're taking some time to celebrate your achievements. Hi there, I'm Martin Cullen, Chair of the University's Alumni Association, and I just wanted to wish you a huge congratulations on your graduation and welcome you to our 200,000 strong alumni community. Really well done, and we look forward to welcoming you to an alumni event as soon as we can. Hi everyone, my name is Will Tudor, I'm an actor. I graduated from Leicester in 2008. I just wanna say a massive congratulations for graduating today in what is an incredibly turbulent, uh, uncertain time. You've done absolutely brilliantly, so congratulations. You should be so proud of yourself, so well done. Go and celebrate, have an amazing time, and all the best for the future. Well done, everyone. Hello, my name is Johnson Long, leader of Hong Kong alumni community. It's been a very tough year in 2020, but you guys made it. Congratulations to all the graduates. For those who want to come to Hong Kong, I'm here and welcome you. Hello, I'm Aaron Porter, a graduate in 2006 and the first Leicester alum to be president of NUS. Today will be one you never forget. Looking back on an experience, I hope you can cherish with fondness. Whether it's the friendships that will last a lifetime, the new experiences and the horizons that have been opened for you, and for some, moving away from home for the first time. Leicester is now an indelible part of your life as you move on to the next chapter. Best of luck. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jonathan Tai, President of Leicester Alumni Ghana. Congratulations on the occasion of your graduation, and we really can't wait to welcome you to the alumni body. Just like we say in Ghana, Akwaaba. Congratulations one more time. Hi, 
this is this once for goldsmith here wow congratulations you made it and one good thing about graduating in lockdown is you don't have to wear a mortarboard trust me those hats are a nightmare especially if you've got an afro plus you are the very first students in history with 2020 vision at last we can go out there and make this crazy old world a much better place. I'm going to be beside you all the way. Aluta continua. This is Jamal Anderson from the Leicester Riders. I just want to wish you the very best for the future. Um, congratulations for graduating in these difficult times. It's amazing that you've done so. And, and I wish you all the best. Take care. Hi, it's uh, Brendan Rogers here from Leicester City. I just wanted to take this opportunity to wish uh, all the graduates at Leicester University big congratulations. Uh, enjoy your graduation day and obviously uh, safely have a great celebration this evening and uh, I'm well done. Okay, so yeah, I would like to thank such congratulations from our alumni and friends of the universities. And you know, since I would like to thank their support to our universities and our students. And now I think it's time for me uh, to make uh, the final uh, remark. Uh, in the past decades, I think we have witnessed how our lives, our business, our society have been transformed by the internet, by the cutting edge computing technologies. Those new computing technologies, including the AIs, big data, Internet of Things, will continue to transform our lives, our business, and our world. Our future actually is in your hand because you are the next generation's computer program, computer engineers, and computer scientists who will continue to change this world. I trust you, you will make a good use of the computing technology you have learned from the university to make positive changes to the world rather than negative one. Here in Leicester, I hope you have not only learned the knowledge and skills on the programming on those cutting edge computing technologies, but also soft skills like resilience, problem solving, critical thinking, and time management. I hope you will benefit all of them for your whole life. Please stay in touch. Please be true to yourself and follow your passion. At the end, I would like to wish, all, wish you all, all the best for your careers and your life. Your amazing careers will start from here, from Leicester. At the end, I would like to present our congratulations videos from our staff members to close this event. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Karim. I'm the senior tutor and lecturer in informatics. I just want to say many, many congratulations for graduating. I wish you all the best and I know you're gonna do great in your life. Remember, we're always here for you even after you graduate, so get in touch. Many congratulations and I'm so happy for you. Take care. Good morning, everyone. My name is Joe. I am a professor in machine learning in informatics. Congratulations to all the graduates. Um, I hope to see you soon in a different program. Congratulations to graduating. You can be really proud of yourself. All the best and stay in touch. Congratulations for your graduation. It's been a wonderful experience working with all of you. And I wish you all the best for your future career. Hello all, huge congratulations on your achievement and on graduating. It's been fantastic to work with you and you've done so well. So well done and be proud of yourselves. We are indeed very proud of you. And I would like to wish you also congrats in Greek. So, bravo, pola sinharitiria. And don't forget, work hard but also play hard. Congratulations to the School of Informatics graduating class of 2020. We wish you the best of luck in the next stage of your careers. Hi everyone, many congratulations on your graduation. 
I do hope that you can enjoy the time under the current circumstances. Uh, I'd just like to say that I very much enjoy teaching everybody computer architecture and of course I wish you all the best in your careers. Um, do stay in touch and bye for now. Congratulations to all our graduates of 2020. We wish you every success in your future adventures. Keep in touch. Hi everyone, congratulations on your achievements. You have all done very well and I wish you the best for your career or further studies. You are graduating today. Congratulations, well done. You can be proud of yourself. I'm sure your families are very proud of you. I wish you all the best for the future, for your career, for your personal life. And I hope you always have good memories of your time at the University of Leicester. Well done. Hello everyone. Congratulations on your graduation. You did it. All the best in your future. May the road rise to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sun shine. Thank you.